review is of the Hawker Hurricane the Mark One, and it is a model by a Trumpeter. It's 124th scale. There are the dimensions, number of parts. We also have photo etched parts. Um, it comes with two different versions that you can paint. One is with the uh, black and white underside, and then they very quickly switched over just to the uh, sky gray. Let's have a look over here. We've got some pictures of the finished model. And uh, looks like it's going to be quite a detailed model. There's some details about the plane. So, let's have a look inside. Here we have a uh, little screws. And lots of parts to go through. there and then this must be for the tail tire and uh, probably for parts of the engine I guess. We'll have to wait and see what that's about. This first one here, very large sprue. This is going to be a very large model. So Looking here, you have a tremendous amount of detail. Look at that. That is really, really incredible uh, molding quality. All the rivet lines and panel lines are recessed. You can see them all the way around the wheel wells there. I mean, really, this is just absolutely tremendous. Exceptional quality. Same thing with the top. And then there's the uh, gun bays there. So... That really is tremendous quality. This next screw here, we have our uh, fuselage. Now these uh, Hawk Hurricanes were made actually out of uh, metal in the front, and they had canvas and wood in the back. And uh, you can see the canvas with some metal parts. You can see some of the rivet lines but really just uh, exceptionally well molded. Same thing with the other side there. It looks like our engine compartment is going to be open. And then this is our wheel well. Also some nice detail there. And probably one of our firewalls there. There is our glass. We've got our canopy, which has also got some nice detail on it. See the rivets there, and then our instrument panel to give you the glass effect. And clear if you want to the size of the uh, of the engine bay. I probably won't be clear. So we have a few loose pieces already, things have come off the uh, screws. Over here we have our engine and our propeller, three blades, looks like uh, maybe our oil pan there, some of the parts of the engine, the uh, covers here for the valve, valve covers, here's the uh, prop shaft, the gearbox there and uh, additional engine parts, all very, very nicely molded. Here we go with the, uh, this must be uh, fuel tanks, and uh, nice detail here. This is for our stabilizer and uh, our tail. Well, actually, this is probably our elevator and flaps, very nicely molded. We also have some photo etch parts here for our 
Uh, looks like engine compartment, including seat belts. And there is the instrument panel. There's the uh, propeller shaft with gearbox. There. So here we have our wheels, there's the classic Hurricane wheels and our wheel well covers. Looks like probably our flaps, ailerons here, uh, air intake and scoop. And there's the other side of the ailerons. We have our uh, wheel or landing gear. It's a really nice quality there. our uh, rudder over there we've got our seat and uh, looks like part of the floor of the cockpit there's our uh, control column and we have more parts of the cockpit and uh, instrument panel there the side of the uh, fuselage lots of extra little details there's our uh, rudder steering and the frame for inside the cockpit So here we have our exhausts, and you can see that they've been molded open, which is awesome. You won't need to, to drill them out. We have our cannons here, machine guns. I'm not sure what those parts are. Looks like this part's uh, come off. I'll have to find that one. Here is our the other one, same thing. So here's the uh, spinner, looks like the sides of the wheel wells here, and then the uh, front, uh, this is the front leading edge of the wing with the gun ports, radiator, and uh, this is the uh, one of the air intakes for the front, and then some body panels. So let's have a look here. And our decals, very large, very nicely printed. We do have some details here. So that's a very, very nice uh, set of decals. Let's have a look at our instructions here. So we have our parts listings. Start off with the uh, cockpit. There's going to be a tremendous amount of detail there for the cockpit. There is our uh, instrument panel, also a lot of detail. We start off with the engine and uh, lots of detail being being put on there. There's our firewall, and we have our uh, stabilizer and elevator. Engine being put on the engine mounts. And we start to put the uh, fuselage parts on the inside of the cockpit, and we can mount the cockpit and engine inside the fuselage. Our tail is put together. This is the uh, door that flaps forward so the pilot can get out. And our riser engine covers. And we've got, uh, that's probably our tanks and wheel wells going on. So all those additional details 
going in there for the real world covers. We've all our weapons, and those are then mounted inside the uh, wings. The wings are then put together. And just tremendous amount of detail. It really is. Now, ailerons and flaps are put on. Wings are then mounted to the uh, frame. Our landing gear are then assembled. As well as our radiators. And all those extra little pieces are then put on the airframe tail wheel. Landing gear are then uh, placed on there and our exhausts. Final spinner is put on as well as our canopy. So all in all this is a tremendous model. It is exceptionally well molded. We've got uh, great decals, tremendous amount of detail, typical trumpeter quality.